definitely like to see a, a big wide chest, which tells you they've got, you know, a big giant airway there through their lungs going into their throat latch. Um, that's very important. An old timer trick will always be when you're at the sales and you're looking to buy a horse is to, to put your, your fist in there in that throat latch and see kind of where it fits. And if it, he's, his is pretty big. So if I can fit my, my uh, whole knuckles, all of them and my, really pretty much my whole hand in there, I mean, that's just telling you he's got a great airway. Um, obviously when you go to the sales, definitely have your, your vet scope. And they'll be able to tell you, you know, if it's an A or a B throat or something like that. But, but this is kind of, your, your old timers trick and, and it'll give you, it really will give you a good idea on uh, where you stand. So when I'm looking at a horse overall, I'd like to just see balance. You know, uh, the textbooks will tell you, you want to see more of that V shape when that shoulder going into the hind and kind of try to make it more of a universal triangle. Mm -hmm. But um, I mean, you can see this horse, he's got a big, powerful shoulder. He, he's got an okay sized hip but he's very well balanced. And for a horse with a with a kind of a long neck, I would say he, he everything kind of goes together and blends the right way. And uh, you know, that's kind of what I what I like to, to look for. And especially with grass horses, you'll see grass horses, even if they're smaller sized, uh, all the good ones have really good, strong shoulders to them. And uh, this horse is acclimate. He's, he's a multiple graded stake winner on the grass, mm -hmm. so he's a good example. But that, that's kind of what I look for in the overall picture. I would say when you're looking at horses in confirmation, uh, as a general rule, the least confirmational flaws your horse will have overall will give you your best chance at having a, a nice horse down the road. There are always exceptions to that rule, and you see it every day. But if you're looking in the grand scheme of things, and and uh, numbers of horses, that, that's really, I, I would say, your, your best chance to, to find a successful horse.